Our next candidate is Barbara Kinsey, a Democrat running in District 5. Originally from Texas, she and her husband both received degrees from Baylor University. After moving to Boone in 1969, her husband Winston taught at ASU for 36 years, and she taught 38 years in North Carolina public schools and at ASU. She currently serves as a member of the Watauga County Board of Education. So, I'm just going to do one minute opening intro question. Why, why did you choose to participate in this forum? Well, I chose, uh, for many reasons, I am a board, a current member of the Board of Education, and so much of recreation has to do with education as well. Well, there is such a link, and I think it's important that as we build our structure uh, more completely for education, uh, for recreation in Wapaka County, that we consider uh, the school facilities that are already here and so forth. So I think it goes hand in hand. Okay. We have two minutes for each of these four questions. So, what role does recreation play in economic development for our community? Oh, the first uh, example I think of, and I think it's okay for me to, to tell this, <coughs> is the example of Lowe's Park Road, Lowe's Home Improvement, which whose headquarters have been in Wilkes County for as long as they have existed until however many years ago they moved uh, down to Lake Norman area. Uh, they told the Wilkes County schools early on that their performance on the test and so forth was not good, that they were not satisfied they as in Lowe's, and that if the county, the schools did not improve drastically, and they were looking at arts, in the community, all those things that do attract people, that they would be moving their headquarters. And we know the rest is history. Uh, they did move, probably for a lot more reasons than that, but uh, companies who are serious about uh, their employees and hiring good employees, et cetera, are gonna look seriously uh, at this business of recreation, education, as I said, it all goes hand in hand. So we need to do our part to offer an environment of education. I'm sorry, recreation. So what role do you see the Board of Commissioners playing to support recreation in our community? Well, I think it is a primary role. Um, the Board of Commissioners has already started uh, working on this several years ago. There was a plan put out in, I believe it was 2009, that was a 10-year plan for Watauga County. It was a very well-documented, well-done plan, and it certainly addressed several pages to recreation in Watauga County. Um, the plan, I think, has sort of been put back on the file cabinet. The copy I have is great on the big one, but there are smaller ones. And if you want to see it, by the way, go to the county office and uh, ask for a plan the Watauga County 10-year plan, and they will, I'm sure, give you one. But it's been talked about for a long time. We have done some great things with recreation. The trails, uh, the bike areas, of course, we have access to <coughs> state parks, to the Blue Ridge Parkway. We are so blessed with so many uh, forms of outdoor recreation. However, I think the area that we need to work on now is some indoor recreation for folks who maybe are not walkers or can't be walkers or uh, cyclists or whatever. We need some places for people to get together to enjoy even playing board games. I saw somewhere that teenagers actually enjoy playing bingo more than anything. Now, can you believe that? I did it first, but this was a good poll. And I thought, hey, that's neat. That's neat. Sometimes they want to sit down and eat with the older people. That's pretty much it. So, the next question is a community recreation center has been an express need of the community for decades, both in county and town planning and in community surveys. Since a YMCA is not coming to Watauga County, what plans would you have to meet this need? Well, just to get down to the nitty gritty and start pursuing one. And people say, well, we don't have money, it would mean raising taxes, blah, blah, blah. Um, I don't see that, that 
maybe cost far, probably far to some of the funds, maybe a great deal of funds. But I think we as community citizens can get started and start coming up with some funds maybe through grants or people who have quite a bit of money that they would like to uh, distribute around. And, and a community center, I think, is a necessary thing. And of course, we get a little bit into this uh, east, west kind of thing. I don't want us to do that. I heard, you know, some rather bitter remarks about don't do this because it will do this or mean this for the future. We can, we can work. We're grown-ups. We're grown-ups. And we can do this together. And we want everybody, as much as possible, to have equal opportunities as far as recreation is concerned. If another community center doesn't have to be a big, fancy building, perhaps we can do it in segments. I've seen some uh, small communities in the area actually attach community centers to the fire departments and so forth, and that might be a possibility to begin with. But I know that we're talking citizens can find a way to make our uh, community centers, community uh, efforts uh, equal to each other, and we can enjoy sharing them with each other in the future. Great. And so last question. Trails and greenways have been shown to be one of the most important recreation amenities in statewide and local surveys. What role can a county play to support the development and building of local trails and greenways? I think that's a given already. We have done a great deal in Watauga County to make those uh, trails and those greenways a possibility. The one thing I think everybody agrees on right now is that we've got to do a good job of taking care of those facilities along the way. You know, it's easy to be all excited, a grand opening of this, that, or the other, but, but then we've got to make sure that all of us, not just people in the recreation department, but all of us, are taking good care of those trails and uh, bikeways and so forth that we already have. I think the sky's the limit for us in that respect, because we already have so many opportunities, we can attach to this one or this one or whatever. I believe I'm correct. It doesn't amount to the sea trail connect with the tobacco trail down in Durham, I think. You know, that's, gosh, it's, it's just exciting to think about it. I won't be walking in those, but it's, it's exciting to see other people doing that. It really is. And uh, I, I seriously just think, you know, that, that we can do whatever we 